Talking all during the playoffs about you guys being opportunistic, uh, especially in, in key situations, and it's the same thing here tonight. Right? Yeah, we just got to find a way to, to get a bounce, get a break, um, find a loose puck, whatever. You know, Card stayed with that play, and uh, you know he made a great, uh, great shot. Um, you know, it had to be a big shot to win this game the way it was going. Um, big two wins, but we, uh, you know, we're halfway there. We know it's. Uh, Tough battle to go. Do you guys feel like something really special is going on here? Happier? Ah, hopefully at the end of it all we can, we can say that. But you know, like I just said, we, we got a long way to go. And um, yeah, ten and zero. That's that's fine. That's great. But we don't we don't win the cup. Uh, you know, in two games in the final. We got to get six more for the Columbia to celebrate on that plate. We don't celebrate. We haven't won anything. So. Talk about uh, going home. What the fans are going to be like in games three and four. Oh, they'll be fired up. Yeah, they'll be excited. Um, you know, they uh, you know, all of LA is excited right now from from what I'm hearing. Uh, phone's blowing up, and, but uh, you know, we, we gotta play good. We can't just go home and, uh, and take it for off the gas. You gotta keep pushing, keep firing, and uh, and, and be even better in front uh, in front of your crowd. How about still a pressure on those guys though right now? I think I went four out of five. For yeah, yeah, but uh, you know they're a great team. We got to give them a lot of credit. They're a great team. They never give up. They haven't given up uh, throughout the playoffs so far. They've been down a lot, and they uh, they're here in the Stanley Cup Finals, so they're doing something right. We got to make sure that we, uh, we keep the foot on the gas at home and, and do the right things. You were all over the puck tonight. We're on the road. I mean, ten and zero is a pretty remarkable thing. Yeah, it is. But uh, you know, we're not anywhere yet. We got to keep going. We got to keep pushing. And, uh, like I said before, the record or whatever, ten and zero, twelve and zero, eighty and zero, doesn't matter. You got to you want to win your last game. Season, and that's, uh, we're not there yet. What about Jeff Carter and what he's been through? You know, the being picked up, the injury that he has been dealing with, everything like that, and then to kind of come up with this big goal. Yeah, he's, you know, he, he makes big plays. He scores big goals. He's just won it pretty much everywhere he's been. Um, so for him to come over, he's been in the media a lot this year. And, um, you know, it's, it's, it's great to see that. Um, he's he's been over here. Like that. Stayed with that play, found the, you know, got by the, got by the defenseman to turn in on that. Big shot. Similar situation for Drew. I mean, it's been an up and down season for him as well. You know, given what his standards and expectations are, and again, it's a good place tonight. Yeah, yeah, a couple big hits, big goal. Um, logged a lot of minutes. I'm sure he was uh, over 30 again. Uh, he just uh, he plays, plays really well in the big games. We've seen that at the Olympics in Vancouver. Um, he, can, he can play well against very, very high competition. Yeah, Marty was. Yeah. Uh, How did you keep that going? Yeah. How did you keep it together? Uh, everybody. It starts from the coaching staff, our, uh, our, uh, our leadership group on the team. Uh, we're always talking on the bench, making sure that we're fine. We're fine. We're, we're composed. We'll find a way to, to get this goal. We'll find a way to win the game, get a bounce. We know Quickie's back there. He kind of calms us all down, too. With the way he plays and how and how great he is back there. So we just uh, in the intermission too. Uh, after the third, we just came in. We knew it was in this room somewhere. We just had to find it, and uh, we came out and had.